happening now. We are hearing from the girlfriend of a woman killed in a terrible crash and high speed chase. This happened last night in High Point at Hamilton Street and Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard. Our Meredith Stutz was there as the woman's partner shared her heartbreak. This is where Gordon Street in High Point starts and last night around 930 a patrol officer noticed a car that drifted into the other lane. That officer decided to follow it. The officer suspecting the driver Anthony Tate was impaired tried to initiate a traffic stop. Police say Tate took off, ran a red light, speeding up to 90 miles an hour, crossed the median, crashed head on with a car, killing the driver, 43 year old Carolyn Chambers. We were there as Chambers longtime girlfriend Karina Rainey came to lay balloons at the crash site. She says Chambers, a mother of three, was on her way home when the unthinkable happened. Heart stopping. Like you, you wouldn't expect, not her, it's like, no, it's not real, it's not her. She was my everything, my world, she meant a lot to a lot of people. The suspect, Anthony Tate, was taken to the hospital and faces a slew of charges, including second degree murder. While Chambers' children and Rainey now come to grips and are still in shock about losing a loved one in a moment's notice. Reporting in High Point, Meredith Stutz, WXII. 12 News.